Jojo, it's time to go, go. And today, we're doing endless battle because today, we're just gonna have a normal chat. And we're going to be talking about these fuckers over here. The JoJo All-Star Battle R DLC Weather f Weather Report Final Poochie Risotto Nero Rudolf von Stroheim and the one that's coming out in a few days Kaicho Nijimura I'm just gonna get the elephant out of the room Nobody in their right mind wanted this motherfucker. To be fair, I've seen people who didn't even want my boy Stroheim. But you know, let's 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 just get into this with some Stroheim. We're going to be playing some Rudolf von Stroheim. But yeah, basically, what this video is about. This is a normal chat, but uh, basically, why is the DLC for this game so fucking dog shit? Why, why does JoJo All Star Battle R have to have the worst DLC no to man? Because we got my boy Stroheim, but our first character was literally Risotto. And the thing that came to mind when I saw Nero in this game, and I'm like, Bro, you just got donutted by Diavolo. I don't know why you're even here, bro. Because that shit's fucking mad goofy. But for the- we got good free DLC, though. We got Weather Report, and we got fucking Final Poochie, who- Final Poochie was originally the OG Poochie. But, uh, we don't really talk about that. But, uh, for the most part, literally, the DLC in this game is, uh, not Part 8, because we need, we are in desperate need of more Part 8 characters. We literally only got fucking one. And, I mean, we did, we, we are, we're now getting another Part 4 character. Like, what? what? 3 and 4 are literally oversaturated in this game. Oh look, it's the first two DLC on the same team, Nero and Rudolf von Stroheim. Because there's only four fucking characters in the actual, like, paid DLC. And yet, they're like, ah, oh, you know what would be a good idea? Okiasu's goddamn brother who is there, I guess. Instead of part eight, not even giving us Toru. Kinda cringe, not gonna lie. Okay, could Stroheim stop running away from me like a little bitch? But, uh... Okay, that was a waste. Uh, basically, the only DLC I like so far that is paid for is Stroheim. Literally, the paid DLC so far has been... Guy who gets donutted. Okiasu's brother, who also dies, I if I remember correctly, from Part 4 fucking dies as well, and then, and then free DLC. Because the fucking free DLC was actually the good shit. But the problem is, we only have one character left, which means we're only gonna get one more part 8 character at most. Which kinda fucking sucks. But hey, at least at least at least we got my boy Stroheim. We got the we got the funny part two man. At least we got Jesus Gyro. Get the fuck down there. Boom. But yeah, we got the fun we got the funny uh we got the funny German man. Which apparently people also have a problem with. Personally, I do not, because he is the German funny man. But, uh... The other problem is that, literally, we got so many characters from the other parts, and only one Part 8 character. And somehow Part 8 has the same amount of characters as a fucking 
random manga that fucking Araki wrote that is not JoJo, which is where fucking Bao is from. Fucking hell. Why is he even in this game? I don't- I didn't think JoJo was the game that needed a- needed another Araki manga crossover collab guest character. Uh, that was a waste. Uh, whoopsie. But, but this game taught me not to get my expectations up for DLC in this game. Because as for the paid shit, I I would have preferred like characters like Tolru, Another World, the Diego, um, any of the other Part 8 characters. Uh, part 6 Jotaro costume, not a character, by the way. I would have lo loved a free DLC for a Part 6 Jotaro costume for Part 4 Jotaro. Because that would be nice to have, since that's the only Jotaro we're missing. Uh, a funny one, a funny one I thought of them adding, since they have fucking handicapped boy over here. Who is a Joe Star? What if we just had Emporio with the uh, weather report from the part six finale? Like if we can have, like if we can have fucking Requiem and Made in Heaven, why the hell can't we have fucking uh, weather report? Fucking uh, Emporio. Because if we can have Iggy in this motherfucker, we can have a tiny ass child. Like I don't see the fucking issue here. But all I know is that, uh, the, like, more part, more of the older parts is not good. Like, we have plenty from most of the parts. And we got all the main characters from part one, part two. Like, part three has way too many. Next, you're telling I bet in the next patch they're gonna be like, oh, what if we added the fucking car, you know? Or the or the fucking boat, you know? Like, like they literally added all of uh, they added like most of they added all like of Dio all of Dio's like human henchmen, but like, but why though? Like fucking who asked for pet shop or fucking like who asked for pet shop or Dar not Darby Darby's not in it yet, and hopefully he stays out of it because Darby is not a fighter. Uh, but, uh, we got fucking, we got almost every fucking henchman. We got Vanilla Ice, we got fucking Pet Shop. Who the fuck asked for Pet Shop? Also, you can play, can we just go back to the fact that they have fucking Bird and fucking Iggy the dog before they added, like, all the important Part 8 characters other than Josuke Part 8? At, the, at this point, I'd see them adding a part nine character before they even before they even add the un, a second part eight character. It's kind of it's kind of fucking insane because honestly, the lack of part eight is hilarious at this point. Like we're getting part four and we're getting part five and we're getting part two. Meanwhile, literally, part eight's just gonna be sitting here with one character for the rest of eternity. Cause I highly doubt at this point they're gonna add a part eight character in the last one. I think the last one's gonna be another random character we don't want. Like the fucking monkey from the ship. Because why not, you know? Like, is it. Oh, I know, they're gonna add fucking parts- Since we got Poochie here, they're gonna add fucking part 6 Dio, you know? They're just gonna add- They're just gonna add Femboy Dio from part 6's flashback sequence. Or, they're gonna add fucking Dio's fucking- Multiple fucking children. Before they even decide to- Before they even decide to have another part 8 character. Like, the part 8 abuse has to stop at some point, right? 
And also, only four characters for the paid DLC? Ugh. Like, that's kind of unforgiving, if you ask me. Like, nothing about the... Like, only four paid DLC, bro. And they all fuck... And they... And aside from Stroheim, in my opinion, all of them fucking... Like, they're all, like, minor characters that I don't give two hoots about. That I don't give two fucking hoots about. So... If, if this game taught me anything... Is that the DLC... Literally, you would think with four characters... That it would go, uh... Quality over quantity. But nah. Nah. Even with only four characters, they only had one good one. And it was... And it was the goddamn German man. And people and people still didn't want the fucking German man. So probably more people think this is even worse DLC, because literally none of the characters are good. It it's just I don't I don't know. It do, it don't make no goddamn sense. It makes Oh, that zoom in just cancelled my Akira. Great. Like, we got characters like Akira and fucking... fucking Yandere bitch from part 4. Why do we need more fucking part 4 characters, bruh? I don't... get it. Like... Like... Stroheim was fine, because we don't have that many part 2 characters, but... Literally anyone from part 3 or part 4? Why? Like, they just keep coming out of literally nowhere. Like, oh yeah. Remember when Ak remember when Okiasu's brother was there and he was a part four villain? Yeah, uh I guess he's in this game now. I, I am curious to see how he plays though. That is the one caveat here is that I don't know how he plays yet because Even though he's a fucking person who shouldn't even be in the game if he's at least fun to play I could could forgive it But I but I don't know As someone who bought the uh, ultimate edition or I think I think it's because I also ultimate edition. I don't know for sure, but I'm one of the people who get gets the DLC a few days early whenever it actually decides to be implemented. Whereas fucking Okiasu's brother is the 22nd, which is still at least a couple days away, maybe more, definitely more. But like, uh, it's just so random how they don't even try to like sugarcoat it either. Like they don't even like make any logical sense when it comes to any of it. They're just like, you know. You know, what if we just added another part four character that nobody asked for? You know? Instead of Toru, literally any of the other uh, part eight characters. Like they like they just they just decided in the writer's room of the DLC, they're like, We have only four characters that are being paid for. So who the fuck can we add? Uh, okay, let's add the German man. Uh, mm -hmm. Let's add the guy who immediately gets donutted by uh, Dopio. Let's add that. Yeah, yeah. What else do we add? Oh, oh, I know. Okiasu's brother who nobody fucking cares about. Because literally the part four villain they always think about. And really only think about. Is Yoshikage Kira. So... So yeah, they 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 got one more chance to at least make it okay DLC. Bro, how much armor do you fucking have, bro? But you know, if the 
If there, there better be at least either more paid DLC later, if this is the quality of shit we're getting, or we're gonna get more free DLC. Cause at that, cause at this point, I'd just take more. Like, I just, I'd unironically probably buy more if you actually give me good fucking characters other than Rudolf von Stroheim. Because, because my man, my man Stroheim is good and all, but he can't carry the entire fucking battle pass, or, or in this case, the DLC pass. Ah. Is one German man, one funny German man, ain't gonna carry this fucking. This fucking DLC loop. Bye. At least the free ones were good. Somehow. Unfortunately. I wish it was better, but, you know. I don't make the rules. I don't. I don't make the rules of uh, whoever's running the DLC, but whoever's running the DLC, uh, I'm not a big fan of you personally, because, yeah, I'm tired of all these part threes, these part fours, hell, I don't even want any part fives, get that shit out of here at this point, we already got everyone that was important, unless you give me Dopio, I'll take Dopio, but no one else. Oh, speak of the, speaking, speaking of the motherfucker who's literally has the same amount of characters in their franchise as Part Eight, Ikoro Hashizawa, aka Bow. Ah, this motherfucker, this motherfucker, this, this ugly ass motherfucker with fucking Super Saiyan hair. Literally got the same amount of characters as part 8 in Jojo Like that's fucking that's fucking absolutely horrible Like that's just not cool man Especially when no one's even heard of this fucking manga before they just know it is Araki's other manga They don't they don't really fucking care We were here for Jojo, and we aren't getting, like, the Jojo we asked for. We're getting Jojo, like, side characters. Because that's a good business practice. Give us, like, a bunch of characters nobody asked for. He's like... Because no one asked for any of these motherfuckers. I was one. I wanted Stroheim, but like, no one in their right mind was asking for this motherfucker before more Part Eight characters. It's just, it's just kind of. I don't know. Seems kind of, kind of dumb. Like if I. Like, if I was in charge of the DLC, I'd be like, you know, we barely got any Part 8 characters, so let's at least get the fucking main villain of Part 8 in there. Because every fran because every part has their main character and their main villain, except for Part 8. Part 8 literally has only my fucking Josuke Part 8. No Toru to be found anywhere. It would be nice to actually get characters from what a lot of people say is a really good part of JoJo. I don't know. I'm not the biggest Part 8 fan myself. But I can't but I can't argue with the majority here. Ah. It's like, 
I may not be the biggest Part 8 fan, but even I can agree when this fucking shit is literally getting cocked royally. Like, even I know when it's getting cucked when they literally only have one character from Part 8. When this fucking random manga nobody read has the same amount of characters. I'm repeating a lot of the same points, I know, but like... I don't really know what else to say about it. I'm just trying to pad this out until I fucking lose. Ah! Like, literally, every villain, every JoJo villain, like, every main part as their main villain, except for Part 8. The Part 1 Dio's in the game. Fucking all three Pillar Men are in the game. Fucking Dio Part 3 is in the game. Kira and, and fucking Kosaku Kira are in the game. Diavolo is in the game. Fucking two versions of Poochie are in the game. Fucking Funny Valentine is in the game. But but no Toru for part eight. I don't think Toru could have been that bad to where that they literally just said, you know, let's just not have the main villain of the part in part eight. Like, it's kind of... It's kind of random. You know what else is random? Why the fuck I'm not dying yet? Like my... my like my Stroheim... Ah! Oh, hi... Oh, hi, Jonna. Jonathan... Justa. At this point, I'd rather... If they're not gonna add Toru, might as well just go straight to Jodio. Because they can't. Because they, because they decided if they're gonna fucking cuck part 8 so much, might as well just start adding part 9. Because that. Like, that's a good idea. Ow. Bonk. Get out of here. Ah! I missed the snipe! No! Ah, 17's fine. Well, that'll do it for this somewhat short video. I already had the the reason I wanted to get this out now and not when he was actually in it whenever the fucking part four motherfucker was actually in the game is because I had this thumbnail ready and I was not waiting a whole nother day when it just turned the 21st when I get him on the 22nd. I was not waiting that long. But uh yeah that'll do it for this short rant on the shitty practice of JoJo DLC. And I will see all you in the next video. So for now, peace out.